Hi guys, Rachel CPR here. Today I am super excited about this video because this video is actually a contest entry for IT Cosmetics. IT Cosmetics stands for Innovative Technology, if you don't know already, which I'm sure you do. And they are doing an IT Girl contest. And for this contest, you have to explain what true beauty means to you or when do you feel most beautiful. When thinking about this question, I really got caught up in the fact that I... I recognize that true beauty for me is when my beauty is coming from the inside and not necessarily external because there are times when I can feel truly happy, truly, truly beautiful, but it, physically I may not look the part of exactly what I'm feeling, but it makes me feel the part and so it makes me feel that that's what I'm portraying as a person. I do feel that when you get dressed up, you put on your fancy clothes and your makeup and your shoes and everything like that, it makes you feel wonderful. But I think that the true beauty is when that is all put on top of a person who is kind, who's honest, who is striving to be spiritually focused. I think that is when I feel most beautiful and when I feel that I am actually portraying my best face because I do feel that beauty is something that comes from the inside of you. It starts there and it goes out from right there. So yes, I was so excited about this contest because it was such a wonderful question to put out there, especially from a cosmetic company. Obviously, they their business is beauty, but knowing true beauty is something else altogether. And I really appreciated that question. They actually chose 250 people who entered this contest randomly just to send out products to them. And I was one of the people that they chose and I was so excited about that. I received this box in the mail and I was super excited. It had all kinds of wonderful goodies in it. I am hoping that you guys will comment below and to say when you feel most beautiful, when you feel at your best, because I did think that this was a really nice thing to think about and just thinking about just learning myself a little bit more. So please comment below. I'm starting off with a clean moisturized face and I am adding my IT Cosmetics number no. 50 Serum Collagen Veil Anti-Aging Primer. I love the way this primer made my skin feel. First thing I normally do to start my makeup process is I fill in my eyebrows. I am using the IT Cosmetics Brow Power Universal Eyebrow Pencil. It is a grayish brown color that matched my eyebrows perfectly. I love the way they made my eyebrows look. After I fill in my eyebrows, I use my LA Girl Pro Concealer to sharpen up the lines. Next I apply my MAC Pro Longwear Concealer mixed with the IT Cosmetics Bye Bye Under Eye Concealer. The Bye Bye Under Eye Concealer was much too light for me but I was, I've heard so many wonderful things about it that I had to give it a try so I mixed it. And now I am using the Live Love Laugh Vitality Face Disc. The it's actually the bronzer in this set to highlight under my eyes and to set my highlighted areas. I love the way this made my skin feel as well. There is light in this product and I love it. Now I'm giving myself a little bit of bronzing with my CoverGirl bronzer. This bronzer is from the Queen. I am now going to take my brush that was sent to me by IT Cosmetics 
and I am going to start applying my colors. I started off with violet. It was a very nice neutral color that was great for a daytime look, which is what I'm going to try to achieve. A daytime look with a little bit of smokiness. If you notice while I am dipping into my palette, I am just touching the palette because this is a very pigmented palette and I wanted to have the colors nice and soft. I took violet and I put it on my lid and then I went above the crease and I blended very, very well with this brush so that it blended out perfectly into my brow bone area. Next I use the color Iconic. Iconic is a deeper brownish purple color that blended very softly with the violet color. Again, these colors are very pigmented so if you do more than a tap into the color you'll end up with too much color for a daytime look. I apply all of the colors underneath my eyes as I'm going in the same order that I apply them on the top so that I have the very same effect on the bottom of my lash line as I did on my eyelid. Now I'm going in with Noir just to emphasize the crease area and the corners of my eyes to smoke it out just a little bit. Again, be very careful with this color because if, it's, if you dab into the color too much, it will give you too much color because it is very pigmented. I love this brush because it blends everything out perfectly. Now I'm going in with the color Sunset and this is just to warm up the look and give it a much more soft in daytime appearance. I absolutely love this color. I've used it for many looks since I've received this palette and it is always perfect. This is the black eyeliner that was sent to me from IT Cosmetics and it is absolutely beautiful. It is very smooth and it goes on without any tugging. I applied lashes and top liner off camera. Now I'm going to apply my blush from Revlon. This is Merlot at Midnight and this is one of my favorite blushes. I am now going in with the pink blush color in my Live Love Laugh palette and I am just going to make it more of a daytime look with my blush. And I am now using my Sonia Kashuk highlighter in bronze to highlight my high points and my cheekbones. And now for lip color. I'm using a pale pink and lip gloss. I love this combination. So this is the finished look and I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please remember to press like. I hope that you remember to leave your comment below to share your feelings on what makes you feel truly beautiful. Thanks for watching guys. Bye.